Charlene with realmeaning.info. Come on, damn me. I'm sorry. I love that song. Um, it's been a long time. I'm sorry. Shouldn't have left you without a dope beat to step. No, I'm okay. I'm just going on and on because I'm into the 90s this week. But today I'm going to talk about what is the difference between a firewall and an antivirus. Sometimes they people get both mixed up. I know I used to back in the day. I really did. I'm like, well, wait a minute. If it's protects your computer, then why do I need a uh, antivirus? But wait a minute, if I have antivirus, then why do I need a firewall? So that's why I'm going to explain why you need both, what they do, and things of that nature. So I'm going to jump right in it. But I'm going to explain it in a way that's easy. That's why the name of my website is easydefinitions.com or realmeaning.info. So a firewall, actually, the job it does is that it stops hackers from getting into your computer through your internet connection. That's how it, that's the job it does. And an antivirus, of course, once you happen to have a, a, a virus in your, on your computer, it scans the, uh, your computer for viruses and it kills your virus. And a firewall can't do that. It can stop a, a hacker from getting into it to, through your internet connection. It can do that. But if, uh, let's say by accident, uh, a virus happens to get through on your computer, it can't kill it. It can't do that. That's when you have to step over and say, hey, antivirus software, I need your help. That's that's the, the difference between the two. You can all, all also look at it like this. Say like uh, you have a mice problem in your house or in your neighborhood, and you want to make sure every hole is covered up so that they don't get in your house. And you put wood in, on every hole that you can think of in your house. That's like a firewall. You cover it up, cover up the holes, so that no, so the mice can't get through. None of the hackers can get through your house through that wood or firewall. But let's say you leave the door wide open for some unknown reason, and a mouse just walks on through like he thinks that he owns the place. Now a firewall that wood won't do you any good because that wood is covering up those holes. But you left the the your front door open so the mouse can just walk on through like George Jefferson, like he owns the place. So. After that, if a firewall can't help you, you need an antivirus program to kill that m mouse or virus that you let through. And we all can, you know, we all have let viruses onto our computer, either through downloading different um, attachments we didn't know was infected, or going to different websites that we didn't know was infected as well. And that's how that it can, you know, be on us. But as far as a firewall, that helps you by keeping your internet connection safe from hackers. Uh, and an antivirus helps you from if you do happen to get a virus onto your computer, it kills it, it scans your computer for any of them and kills it right then and there. And that's something a firewall cannot do, but you need both. So both are crucial to computing and especially being on the internet. And if you have any questions whatsoever, please email me, join my, or subscribe my YouTube channel if you like to laugh and learn. And I hope that I have explained this and it's much easier now. Thank you and thank you for jamming with me at the beginning. All right, I, you have a great day. All right, I'm going to eat now. All right, bye-bye.